us now Dr. Abdullah Al Maghrabi, Registrar of Cardiology, University of Alexandria. Hello, Doctor. How are Hello. you? Um, what do you think about CardioAlex 2017, and is it uh, meeting your expectations? Uh, the last CardioAlex, you mean? 2017? Yes. Yeah, it, it was um, the normal procedure of CardioAlex every year. Uh -huh. uh, it uh, brings all the updates. It, um, all of the state of the arts articles, um, it brings more uh, and more international speakers uh, and uh, international figures. Okay, and this year? <laughs> this year I hope to be um, um, more and more better in, um, uh, in bringing also uh, the state of the art articles and the new techniques, uh, the new data about uh, cardiology and uh, uh, every branch in cardiology. Okay. Um... What are you going to present this year? Uh, just a, uh, inter a interactive uh, clinical cases uh, in echocardiography and in uh, uh, multimodality imaging, which is my concern uh, in reality. Okay. Uh, can you talk about um, uh, aortic aneurysm and the dissection? Uh, aortic aneurysm means uh, the dilatation uh, of um, the aorta. Aorta is the main vessel of uh, our cardiovascular system, the largest vessel at all. And uh, it means that it is dilated pathologically. Uh, I mean, it is a disease mm -hmm. of the dilatation, not just physiological, uh, like in uh, those playing sports or like uh, something like that. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, this aneurysmal dilatation or this pathological dilatation uh, carries a risk for dissection, which uh, means uh, a cut in the wall of the artery, mm -hmm. which is almost lethal and uh, kill the patient within less than 24 hours, if not intervened by surgery immediately. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, is heart failure cured? Uh, actually, heart failure is not cured till uh, nowadays, but uh, by, by the development of new drugs, by the development of new techniques, it can be uh, controlled, uh, not cured. Controlled means that the symptoms of the patients can be controlled to uh, let the patient do his uh, at least uh, basic daily activities. Okay. Um, what is isolated systolic hypertension? Yeah, isolated systolic hypertension means that the systolic blood pressure is elevated, but the diastolic blood pressure is normal. It means that the systolic blood pressure is more than 140, mm -hmm. while still the diastolic blood pressure is less than 90. Mm -hmm. uh, it is uh, more common in the elderly uh, patients, uh, but less common in uh, the uh, average age. Okay. Thank you a lot, Doctor. Thank you. Very nice to meet you.